We back. And like I said a while ago, we got some topics today we're going to talk about called Hell No. Somebody called me the other night, 2 in the morning, wanting to borrow $30. At 2 in the morning, you need $30. Hell no. Man, I really need it. You don't need no $30 no damn 2 in the morning. What's going on? Talk to me. Oh, I need it. I'm trying to go to work. When you get a job, fam, I ain't seen you put in no L. I ain't seen you doing no work. 2 in the morning, you need $30. Come on, you want some else. So I'm letting y'all know right now, if you got anybody calling your phone 2, 3 in the morning, especially if you got a girl at the crib, she thinks it's some female hitting you up. You know I ain't lying? Who that calling you 2, 3 in the morning? It ain't Jake from State Farm. I bet you that. And they say, man, I need $20, $30. Hell no. Don't call me no more. Now, I know somebody right now dealing with the same thing I'm dealing with. I got each and everybody calling me. They want this. They want that. They want money. They need, They got all kind of ideas. They got all kind of ideas. All kind of ideas. But when it's time to put the plan in play, they ain't nowhere to be found. Tell me I'm lying. Some hell and all topics going on with him. And since we on the hell and all topic, let's get down, straight down to the business. Let's get down to Rick Ross in the game. Some of y'all say game cloud chasing. What the hell was Rick Ross doing when he was calling out Drake? Pop calling the kettle black. Hell no, Ricky Rose. You put that damn Twitter fist down and get your big ass in the booth. We want to hear you rap. Talking about the game hungry. We know you ain't. Because your big ass going to eat each and every day. Lemon pepper wing stop. Huh. Get your ass in the booth. Get in the booth with the wing stops as you ask me. We got some rapping to do. We ain't gonna pick and choose who we wanna rap again. No. You say you the greatest. You say you better than Biggie. Damn it, prove it. I ain't mad at the game right now. Game wants some competition. And I want it too. God damn it. Pete Diddy and his son done dropped a diss track. Yeah, King Kong. Talk about you 50. Come here. You, I don't blame him. Y'all can say what y'all want to say. I don't blame King Kong. You got something to say about my daddy? Then I'm coming at each and every one of y'all. Locked and loaded. Now listen to me, King Kong. Your daddy is what he is. Now take that. Take it. Yeah, you got to take it. Your daddy dissing it. Now you going to take it. But I like the diss track. I like I like the, the honesty, the braveness that you have. You know what, man? I ain't going to let y'all disrespect my father like that. At the end of the day, whether he right or wrong, he's still my father. I'm going to take up for him. I love it. But guess what? A lot coming with that. A lot going to come with that. Defending your daddy or the accusations that he have. But, hey, as man to man, I respect it. But your balls got to be better than what they were, fam. Now, you done had two or three months to get your bars together, and you come out with some shit like that. I'm going to need everybody look in the camera. I need all y'all to say it with me. Trash. Because that's what it was. Trash. Now, Pete Diddy, you got some goddamn nerd Mother's Day coming on here telling all your everybody happy Mother's Day. Stop it. You know everybody don't like you, Diddy. They in the comments talking bad about Cut your comments off, fam. All that negativity in your come, cut, cut it off, Combs. I mean, brother love, cut it off. Don't nobody want to see that. I know I don't. I am want to see positivity going on in the world. But, you know, it's always going to be some negativity somewhere. Now, let me go over to Kendrick and Drake. Who told y'all to call it truce? Ain't no damn truce. We ain't announced no winner yet. No. I want to see y'all dropping hits again. Family matters. Meeting the Grams. Yeah, them were hits. But you fans ruined it. You ruined it. Now y'all going back on Twitter saying Kendrick stole the tweets and all this and that. Saying Drake stole ball. Stop it. Just let these two men do what they do. I told y'all uh, last week, the only people that's winning is the record labels. That's it. We ain't winning. Y'all in the comments fighting amongst one another. Want to fight and kill, but won't fight on the job. Fight your fight them damn jobs. Quit all this stealing and killing and get your ass down there and get you a J-O-B. You need your one. Nobody's going to take care of y'all grown-ass men. Never. You grown-ass men sitting around here won't need women to take care of y'all. Never. That's why these women cheating on y'all too. Like Lucille. Yeah, Lucille. You thought the grass was green on the other side with uh, leaving Charles, but you found out it was artificial. 
Now, somebody make it make sense, Lucille. You didn't want to commit adultery, but you were fine with foreign K. Trash! Thought you were going to get the doctor some and lay up and pillow talk. But no, I got something to tell you, Lucille. But well, what you want to tell me, Maurice? I'm engaged. What? I'm engaged. Then you want to run home to Charles and, have, and look at oh, his daughter cooking a nice, good meal for her father. But Charles say, I got to hit the road. Charles didn't even smell the meal, y'all. Do you hear me? And Lucille want to run behind him. I hope it's everything you dreamed of. You damn right it is. Now you talking about God, your man. No, he ain't. He your heavenly father. That's it. Sick of you women thinking y'all slick and smart. Then when you get in trouble, you want to run the guy. No. You're going to go through your trials and tribulations, Lucille. Two weeks ago, she had every right to do what she's doing. Charles didn't want her. No, remember? Charles was trying to get some of that cookie cake. She didn't want to give him none. So he stepped out with Mabel. Because Mabel was what? Abel? Come here. Come here. She got the kissing Charles on the back of his neck. He got the melting white Skittles in the summertime when they're in your pocket. Come here. Come here. Hey, man, y'all know how I be rocking and rolling over here. More NBA playoff talk coming up. Knicks and Pacers. Hey, Spike Lee, where you at? 